Maldives, right? Okay. So this is Maldives. I'm staying in a villa that's over the water right now. So yeah. Hi everyone. Uh, today we're in Maldives. Uh, so as you can see behind, I'll show you guys the place later. Um, I'm still going to do a drink review because, well, work doesn't stop just because you're on vacation, right? Okay, uh, today I'm just going to show you what we're going to review. Uh, today we're going to review this Milo chocolate milk food drink, they call it here. I know there's Milo all over the world as well. I've already done, I think, a Milo review. But this one's quite interesting because apparently it can stay fresh without refrigeration. So if you can see, right? Oh god. So the writing here says it can stay fresh without refrigeration. So that means because the place, um, uh, Maldives, other than the resort, people are not living in the conditions first world countries are living in. Okay? So they don't have, all of them don't have refrigeration. So Milo made this one to be chilled. It means it will still be cold even without refrigeration. It's quite amazing to be honest. So all it has to do is, all I have to do is just shake it and then drink it chilled. Um, I also couldn't find a normal looking glass. So we're going to have to use a wine glass, I guess. Right? So let's just get started. Um, I'm just going to give you guys a couple of facts as well. Uh, so apparently in 2050, there will no longer be a Maldives because it will sink. There, there won't be any more. I'll, I'll show you the Maldives, how it looks like. Uh, second one is the smallest Muslim country in the world. And third is that it has over a thousand islands. So I'm just going to take 30 seconds just to take you guys around to see Maldives, right? Okay. So this is Maldives. I'm staying in a villa that's over the water right now. So yeah. That's it? Alright, cool. Let's continue with the review, yeah? I'm talking a little bit fast because I'm still on the way my, my vacation, so... Okay, let's just have a taste. Let's just shake it first, right? Okay, and just poke the hole. At least it stays fresh without refrigeration. Alright, before that, like, just, just look at this bottle thing. It's like, usually you have it like in a triangular form, but this one, it has like... I don't know why they made it like this. Maybe for easier packaging, you can just stack two of them together, upside down. Maybe. It's a cool that packaging though. I've never seen this before. Apparently, it's called Tetra Wedge. Tetra Pack Wedge. Yeah, this one. Cool. So, shake again. And let's see how, how whether it's still cold. I bought it from a shop that doesn't even put it on the, in the side of the refrigerator. So, let's insert a straw. Okay, uh, let's pour it out in our wine glass, apparently. Alright, so you can see the color. I mean, it's a normal brown color. So it looks like normal Milo. It smells like normal Milo, but let's see if it's actually. It is actually. You can see like, it's quite hot here. I think the temperature is about 40 here. I can see that it's actually, there's like traces of dew. Or maybe it's just a Milo, right? Let's see if it's still cold. Cheers. I don't think so. It tastes like room temperature Milo. It's not cold. So I don't understand why it's like, oh, I think I'm mistaken. I think it says shake and then drink chill. That means I should add ice to it. Um, yeah, so okay, other than that, um, you know that some, did you know that some places, countries, Milo tastes different? But this one does taste like the Malaysian Milo. So that's really nothing much. It just tastes like normal Milo. I think the, the bottle, I'm oh, sorry, the, the container is quite interesting. So that's about it. Um, yeah, if you do see this kind of Milo, just buy it. It's the same thing, yeah? Right, so that's it guys. Thanks. Cheers.